Hey guys, just a quick video about the antique torture lamps in my living room. I finally got around to converting them all to using the proper type of shade holders. This one here was the first one I found at a thrift store and one of the few that I found the shade and base together, but it still had the type of base with set screws. So I'm talking to lighting experts and collectors. They told me somebody probably bought that shade and base together at a store or perhaps even bought that shade to replace a broken shade for the base or something like that. So they could have, they, you know, presumably came together originally, but they weren't designed to go together. It'd be the equivalent of buying, like, a set of 36-inch blades for a 52-inch motor new from the, you know, showroom or whatever. So I decided, since I'd already modified the base to have a nightlight, I might as well modify the top part, too. So I, I got a bunch of these different lamp fitters. This is the smaller ornate one. I did that there. This one here was a base that I found at the thrift store and I added a nightlight to and then I put the plain kind here. And this one here was a base I got off Craigslist and I added a nightlight to and I put the larger of the ornate fitters. You can see it's got this additional fanciness here. And let's turn them on just so you can see. This one, the shade doesn't quite fit in there, so I might take it apart and tweak it at some point. I think I need to get like a grinder for a Dremel or something. This one came from the, from the Craigslist. This is, you know, shade and base go together. This one came from Craigslist. The shade and base go together. This one came from Craigslist. The shade and base go together. These are a little newer here. This one, the shade came from thrift store and the base came from a different thrift store. Okay. Thanks for watching.